Hey guys, what's going on? It's Wasim here from the channel Handsome Smiles. Thank you for joining me on another Franks video. Today we're going to be looking at a oud oil. It's from the house of Habs Oud and this one is called Dukhan. Dukhan is an Arabic word meaning smoke and this oud was distilled in 2015 from wild agwood trees from the uh, country of Malaysia. So what does Dukhan actually smell like? When I first applied this oud onto my skin it opens up with a very dark, dry smokiness with a very faint hint of dusty woodiness. In the opening, it's very, very dark and quite dry, but as the scent uh, develops on your skin, the, the dark, dry sort of smokiness eases and it becomes much more smoother, the smoky aspect of this scent. The, the smokiness that I pick up in the opening is very much like a coal burning. Uh, I don't really pick up woods being burnt at this stage or incense being burnt. It's more just of thick, thick, very thick smoke. Imagine a volcano and there's just smoke coming out of this volcano. That's the sort of feeling that you get this warm smokiness all around you. And that's what you pretty much get in the opening. However, after a few minutes or so, this uh, this oud really changes. It keeps the smoky aspect, but it's not uh, pretty much smoke in your face. The the scent of smokiness that you pick up is now due to very high quality woods being burnt. Like I've said, the the whole composition of this oud, even though it's smoky, it does not have like an incensey smell per se. There's no incense. There's no frankincense. There's no luban or myrrh being burnt. It's more. The smokiness is coming from the smell of woods being burnt. Imagine yourself being by a campfire. That's the type of uh, the smoky sort of feel that you pick up. As the scent develops into the heart, it still has this smoky woods being burnt, but it then develops to have a touch of very faint sweetness to the composition. It's like there's a note of amber in this scent. It gives a sweetness to the composition, a very faint sweetness, which helps to ease the overall smoky aspect of this scent. Now, I've said there's a note of amber in there. Obviously, there's no note in here. There's no, this is not a mukalla. This is not a, this is, this oil it hasn't been created by perfumer. This is a smell of the oud, which is coming out of a tree, a wood. So, but it has a sort of ambery sort of feel, which gives it the sweetness. As the scent dries down, it really eases from the opening. In the opening, it was just thick smoke and into the heart, it's just like these high quality woods being burnt by the campfire. Uh, and you get some touches of sweetness as well, ambery sweetness, but into the dry down, this one really eases off and it just, uh, it smells, like you still get the smoky woods, but it's like very much eased and very much more relaxed. It's like sitting by a campfire, you're just chilling and you just get the smell of these very, very gentle, smoky woods being burnt. It, the, when you wear this oud into the dry down, it really puts you in a very relaxed mood because it just smells like you're chilling by the campfire. It's really warm, lovely campfire and you're just getting whiffs of the high quality woods being burnt. In terms of performance, Dukhan, I got longevity around six to eight hours in most wearings and the projection was moderate. It's not screaming off your skin and it's not too soft that you can't smell it. It's pretty much moderate throughout. Uh, sure, in the opening, there's that thick smokiness that you pick up. But for me, as the scent develops and dries down, it's more about these really high quality, beautiful woods being burnt. There's a lot of uh, smoky, incensey types of ouds, like Aroha Kaku from Ensa Oud, Udul Q from Ensar Oud as well, and those are extremely strong, extremely powerful. Uh, Aroha Kyaku has like a, a sweetness, syrupy barbecue sort of smell, and Udul Q is full on smokiness. This is much more tame, much more gentler than them two, and much more wearable. Uh, this is a, an excellent oud if you want a smoky oud which is not too overbearing. Uh, Dukan from Habs Oud is a perfect one. I was really impressed by this one. I really enjoyed the relaxing sort of feel that I got and I really enjoyed the smoky aspect of this oud. So overall rating, Dukan from Habs Oud gets a high score of 4.5 out of 5. Guys, I hope you've enjoyed this review. If you have, then please do leave me a like and a comment below. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, make sure you do. 
Until next time, my friends, see you later.